So in this live demo, we're going to show how users can sign to Mbox Capital Portal using their social media account. So on the left, I have the Mbox UI for administrator. So all you have to do is just go to the Capital Portal setting and enable social media sign-in. Depends on which one you prefer. I have already enabled Facebook and Google and LinkedIn as well. So previously, I have also enabled email OTP. So you can combine multiple sign-in options on one Capital Portal page. So on the user side, I'm just going to do a test. I've already connected to the SSID. So when the users start to browse, they will be asked to log in. So it depends on the user's preference. They can sign using the email OTP, or they can just click to sign using social media account. So I'm just going to click on Facebook. So because I've already entered my Facebook account previously, so the browser already cached my credentials. And once I click on the button, I'm automatically logged in. So if I just go to show my status, I've already logged in. And if you go to the administrator interface, you can actually see the user's profile is automatically pulled on and stored in the Mbox database. And you can see the user info, whatever that you can pull from the Facebook public profile is automatically stored in the database. And at the same time, the user is attached to an access profile where you can put, uh, do the next level of control for the users who sign using Facebook access speed or time. You can actually give different speed or control for users signing using different option because when they sign in, they're automatically attached to a different profile. You can set different controls for different profile. Then the user sessions are recorded on the system as well. The user ID, MAC address, IP, and hospital ID. You can also configure reports to export out the user's info, whatever you have collected in the database, to export it out into your email or uh, whichever email that you prefer on a daily or weekly basis. You can customize the reporting module from here, or you can manually click to export out the user's data into the CSV. The box does come with a dashboard, analytics dashboard for you to analyze and report the users, whoever sign options, unique user, or uh, Facebook or Twitter and country, if the data is available from here. So all this data are available in the system and can be reported using the scheduled reporter. We're going to have a separate session talking about running marketing campaigns, because once you have the data collected, you can run email or SMS campaigns to whoever that have signed into the system before. That's all for this demo. Thank you very much for watching.